Hey everyone, wanted to share with you another quick tip on these 12 valve conversions. Uh, what we've got here is the P-pump. We've got the throttle um, lever here and we have the standard throttle cable off of a common rail. The This is kind of the plate that mounts up. It's got all of the throttle levers that goes it's where it grabs the TV cable. Um, it's also where the uh, the, uh, why can't I think of it right now? Cruise control cable would come in here as well. Um, so anyway, but the point of this video is, um, the common rail throttle cables have a larger ball on the end of the, uh, lever than they do on P-pumps. So what you need to do is if you want to have a similar setup, so we're using just the factory cable here coming over to the P-pump, we just went ahead and chopped the ball off of our normal P-pump uh, throttle lever, and then we went ahead and welded on a little bit bigger ball um, that matched up with the common rail setup. You could probably achieve the same thing that we did by buying... Uh, I think it's an apps conversion sensor for a P-pump swap for 24-valve 24, 24 P-pump to P-pump. So this would be more VP44 type stuff. Um, but I believe they also have the larger ball so that it would line up with this here. So that's just a little nugget that we've run into that you might want to know while you're getting ready to, or if you're preparing to or getting ready for your own swap. All right, hope that helps.